Hi everyone, this is Coach DeMarco. In today's edition of Focus, I'm going to discuss with you after timeout situations, or ATOs, which will be critical to the success of your program, especially as you get into the postseason. This clip is going to be unique to other clips that you see on social media because it's going to focus on defense, but most of the other clips I see out there focus on offensive ATOs and sets that you can run against your opponent. As a defensive-minded coach, I believe it was as important for us to focus on defensive ATOs as it was on the offensive end of the floor. That proved to be true because in this situation, we were able to get a stop in one of our state tournament games in advance to the sectional finals as a result. In this clip that I'm going to show you right now, there was about 15 seconds left in the game. We typically had played some type of 2-3 matchup zone against opponents, and we had specific responsibilities in the zone. In this clip, we decided to put a madman like our press on the ball, jumping up and down. We knew with this opponent that these players out here were not shooters, and typically their focus was the weak side block or getting the ball out to the ball side wing to one of their two shooters, one of whom is the inbounder here and the other player out here. They had done that throughout the season. So we knew if we could try to angle and take away the weak side cut and keep one player in the middle, which was actually part of our game plan two games previously when they had a really tall post player they tried to lob the ball up to. So we kept a player in the middle and put a jumper on the ball. We would force them to throw out to this player, and we had two of our defenders out on the perimeter who were ready to actually jump and double-team this player. We were going to take the inbound pass away and then protect the basket. We hoped that that would have forced a turnover. Fortunately, in this situation, we didn't even have to do that because they forced the ball into the weak side and ended up turning it over. This was a crucial stop for us with about under 15 seconds left in the game and one that helped us advance in the playoffs as an ATO.